All right, hi. The Wabtec Corporation Operation Maintenance and Instructions, um, ABDX SS Control Valve Part Number Six Six Four Seven Four Two ADX SS Aluminum Service Portion and ADX SS Aluminum Emergency Portion, August Two Thousand Three. You know, the following description operation is based on the device and components being new of the device and components having been um, this by the device if components having been repaired or tested and installed maintained in accordance with the instruction and this by the other app Wadtech Corporation publications. Warning, at this time any part of the device operation with the complete device must pass through the test as prescribed in the latest issue with the Wabtec testing specification time to device applied with the brake equipment arrangement. The stationary vehicle testing must be made to ensure the device functions properly. The total brake equipment arrangement consult your local Wabtec Corporation representative to identify the test specification the latest revision date of the covered device. Important. On um, Webtech Corporation supplied are to be used in the repair of the devices in order to obtain satisfactory operation. Um, commercial available non uh, OEM parts part of the unacceptable. Um, the part numbers of the associated description and property of WAPTEP Corporation may not be replicated in any manner or form without prior sole written consent of the officer of WAPTEC Corporation. All right, important. The valve is not is not as applied for freight cars assigned for the interchange of the North American Continent Railroads. Uh, diagrammic view, release and charging position. Description, the AB single freight car with the air brake equipment of the ABDX control type of control valve function compatible with the equipment with the AB, ABD, ABDW control valve correctly with the ABDX control valve must be applied to the specific length of the car. It's the ABDX um, type of control valve improves on uh, slight with braking providing with a shorter response in time, shorter brake with the certain under pressure building up the time. This is an initial quick surface function improved with the new surface position, diaphragm, diaphragm clamping agreement. Other benefits of the ABDX type of the control, uh, control valve included with the under emergency UDEM protection improvement with protection against leaks and eliminate the need for auxiliary continuous quick serv serv service. 1-1, one, one, the following description of the control valve with the part of the ABA freight car or ABA, or air brake equipment with the ABDX type of the control valve. 1-1, one, one, um, ABD type of control valve. The ABDX type of the control valve control flow of the air to the brake cylinder and charge the reserve, and charge, into the charge of the reserve. It consists of the brake pipe, the service portion, and emergency portion. 112 brake pipe ABDX control valve the AR AB type of the pipe bracket this this is a two phase bracket which is mounted with the service emergency portion figure 2 and 3 show the portion of the identification of each of the phase of the pipe of the brake is semi, semi permanently bolted to the car the pipe connections may be made in adjustment welding fittings is secured to the machine flanging pads of the pipe on the pipe bracket no pipe connections to be distributed with removing the replacing the service emergency portion the brake pipe contains the quick action chain with removing the stranger with provided long life with minimizing the max passage of the dirt particles to the valve of the brake cylinder pipe connection figure four shows the pipe bracket phase where the pipe connections are made each of the portion is identified by the number name our figure two shows the pipe bracket service phase portion um a the auxiliary reserve to the brake pipe uh, a b auxiliary reserve b the brake pipe um b two the strainer not cavity c three the emergency phase branches c and four C2 and C4, um, C4, the passages to C3, and E2, the emergency reserve for the emergency phase, EX, the retaining valve, figure 3, the pipe, pipe bracket, emergency phase, B, the to the brake pipe, B4, to the brake pipe, passage to B, C, to the brake cylinder, C2, to the passage to C3, C3, service phase, and branch ports of C2 and C4, E3, the emergency reserve and service phase, and QAC, quick action chamber. Figure 4, the pipe bracket, face pipe connections. 1, brake pipe. 2, emergency reserve. Um, 1, the brake pipe is 1 inch, and the rest of the flange sizes for port 2, 3, 5, and 10 are 3, um, two, three, 2, 3, and 5 are 3 quarters of an inch, which are the emergency brake reserve. 2, 3, the brake cylinder, and 5, the auxiliary reserve. 10, the retainer is 3 eighths of an inch. 
All right, one three one one three three service portion. The service portion controls the flow of the air through the auxiliary reserve of the brakes on the during the service application uh, re recharging the auxiliary emergency reserve of the exhaust brake pipe during the relief the accelerated accelerated release of the future speeds up the recharging of the brake pipe during the release of the selecting service application by the use of a small amount of air emergency reserve. The service portion includes the large capacity main manual release valve. The release valve offers a choice for the exhausting only with the brake cylinder exhausting the auxiliary reserve and the brake cylinder exhausting both reserves on the brake cylinder. Figure two shows the port of the indication of the service portion bolting phase. The ABDX SS service portion has been tuned to optimize the quick service function of short cars. All right, 114, emergency portion. The emergency portion controls the flow of the air bolt to reserve the air brake to the brake cylinder during the emergency um, application. The emergency application can be obtained within any time regardless of the existing state of the service application with the release provided with the brake pipe pressure has not been reduced below 45 PSI in the initiating the emergency. Emergency brake pipe pressure, air pressure approximately 20% of higher than obtained with the full service brake application. The emergency brake cylinder pressure is developed in two stages, thus reducing train slack action. The emergency portion also contains accelerated application with accelerated the service build up of the brake cylinder pressure with the, ooh, uh, tra through the train locally ventilating pipe for each pipe brake pipe each at, car, at each car. The ABDX service emergency portion tuned to optimize the future of the short cars um, within less than 45 feet of the brake pipe. The emergency accelerated release fee, um, speeds up the recharge of the brake pipe release of the emergency application by using the air brake cylinder and auxiliary reserve. 2.0 break um 2.0 operation for the refer to the Wabtec 5062-19 operation ABDX SS control valve. Three maintenance schedule important of the ABDX SS control valve should be removed. The equipment arrangement taken to the shop completely disassembled the parts clean and lubricated assembled with the new Wabtec Corporation rubber parts. Other specified Wabtec Corporation valve is tested in accord with the following vehicle application schedule more frequently if surface conditions in in indicate. Recommendation, uh, recommendative type of the application for eight and at frequency at every once every not exceeding 12 years. 4.0 parts and catalog information. 4.1 parts and catalog. Important when ordering replacement parts for the ABDX SS control valve part number 664742. Any of the components portion refer to the current issue of the Wabtec Court Corporation parts catalog 3225. 50S6. The reference number is used the publication that used the part of the catalog may differ. Check with the descriptive part of the name to be sure the desired part is ordered. Replacement part. Important to obtain satisfactory operation reliability of the ABDX SS control valve. Only the Wabtap Corporation replacement parts are to be used. The main maintenance of the ABDX SS control valve commercially available that parts for the unacceptable. 5.0 Safety Procedures and Warnings Regular car builder and owner operating property and or safety shop safety procedures must be followed when performing any of the work of the ABDX SS control valve and its work components. The work area should be clean. Um, figure 5 shows the ABDX SS control valve part number 664742. Warning: There are following statements. Warning: Apply all in part of the uh, all or in part where the, wherever the symbol uh, triangle exclamation point appears with maintenance procedure failure to observe the precautions may result in serious injury for the following performing work or bystanders. All right, portion of the weight in excess of 30 pounds for the use of the weight of the hauling. The portions preclude injury due to the possible exhausting air of the high described level of noise associated with it in the device during testing. It recommends the efficient hearing eye protection be used intended to minimize the possibility of hearing an eye injury with operative personnel near the track. The use of the air injet, which, which must be less than 30 psi of G, um, to blow the parts clean and to blow the after them being cleaned as the solvent will, will cause the particles and drip dirt and droplets from the cleaning solvent to be airborne. Wire brushing may cause may also cause particle for the dirt and rust and scale to be blown airborne. This condition may also cause skin and eye irritation. When using the air jet, do not direct toward the, any other person. Improper, improper, improper use of the air jet could result in bodily injury. Personal air eye protection must be worn when performing any work with the devices and components in parts to avoid possible injury with the eyes. The using of the solvent and lubricant can be involved. The health of safety standard manufacturer solvent lubrication should be contacted with the safety data, such as OSHA form OSHA 20 is equivalent in the recommendation precautions and procedure for the manufacturer should follow. Performing while performing any test of the work on the device and equipment while they're on they are on vehicles on tar, on car tests, the special precautions must be taken to ensure the vehicle movement and not occur, which could result in the injury personnel or damage to the equipment. 
Within performing procedure of the following springs within the assembly may be under load exer exercise care so, so that no parts within inadvertently expelled. The inadvertently expelled parts may cause bodily injury and damage parts. Air, air supply, all air supplies to the device or any two component part must, must be cut off of and any of the air device allowed to the vent before the device and or any component before being part removed from the equipment arrangement. Bottled up air inside, bottled up air under the pressure, even though the air supply is cut off, many gaskets many cut, may cause the gasket particles to become airborne, increase the sound level of the device, and any component part with the removed from the equipment arrangement. Personal I and I protection must be worn care taken to avoid personal injury performing any work of the device and any component part. An adequate supportive lifting device must be available to support the device and valve portions during removal, installation, and maintenance procedures. 6.0 cleaning solvent lubrication sealant. 6.1 cleaning solvent. 6.11 the means of the cleaning of the reusable parts of the ABDX SS type of the control valve must be an alphabetic, olefic, hydrocarbic solvent, must be, such as mineral spirits or nap naphtha, a heated aqueous biodegradable detergent and rinse. Important cleaning materials are to be used in well ventilated areas. 6.2 lubrication and lubrication um, triple valve oil current air AR specification M912 dry graphite M913 brake cylinder lubricant M914 6.2.1 the O-ring and the O-ring groove and the O-ring bearing strip of the bearings must be lubricated in the number 2 silicone grease swap deck corporation specification M07 680-02 industry delegation M mil G4340 oh, sorry 4343 such as the down coming uh corporation down coming fifty five. 6.2. The threads of the choke valves and all of the removable parts as well as the threaded parts may be later too difficult to remove. The most be a Loctite product called the Verbra Seal number 517. Um, Verbra Seal plugs are fully threaded in place. However, the discretion should be used on tightening of the choke to facilitate the removal. 6.3. Lock Sealant. Um, 6.3.1. Lock Sealant. Westinghouse Air Brake Company. Specification M074990. Such as the light Loctite Corporation TL242 is required to application certain threads. 7. Maintenance Procedure 71. On car maintenance procedure is important. On car maintenance is limited to the removal of replacement component parts on the on car repair valve is attempted. 712. Special tools. Important the information shown in figure 6 through 11 is making the tools to furnish conveniency. Wabtech Corporation shall have no responsibility for the tools with the not manufacturable with the responsible the results when using the specified tools using clam, specified thread and part threaded part third parties. Portion of removal insulation on car 721 a caution um, important all car builders owners operating property safety procedures in addition with the warning or listed in section 5 of the publication must adhere to 722 a caution important the handbrake of the um, must be applied with the wheels of the car choke to prevent any intentional car movement warning placards including the work is being performed in place on about the car 723 um, caution important all air flow from the ABDX SS control valve must be allowed to deplete and subsequently be cut off off. Figure 6 shows the hand tool diaphragm of the breaker corners, remover bars approximately 8 inches by 3 and 3 32 of an inch, 3 quarters of an inch material steel, 1 inch, 3 quarters of an inch, 1 quarter inch radius. 5. Figure 7 is a mandrel of the insulation O rings. It has the piston, spool, valve, mandrel, air hole, and O rings. Figure 8 shows the service piston assembly, um, section A, the guide valve, the slide valve, the guide valve, um, the guarding valve, the graduating valve spring, um, piston stem, slide, slide valve spring, fixture, black plate, visual brake vise, roll pin, fixture, blake pipe, great, 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 great graduation valve, fixture body running, run, rolling in place, and valve, spring valve plate, seat. Figure nine, limiting valve, pant, piston, spanner, wrench, um, one in one in twenty thousand, one hundred twenty thousand an inch drill hole, two holes, seven and a half, seven inch, seven sixteenth of an inch drill, um, three quarters of an inch from the one and one half inch, um, three quarter inch centered. The drill holes are three and one thirty one sixty fours from the outside of the one and a half inch. The six inches um, of the material steel bar breaker corners removal type of the manufacturer steep um, one eighth of an inch by three eighths of an inch steel dial pin two required press and pull in place. Service accelerated release valve piston spren spren wrench. Breaks at the corner remove the bars one and quarter inch by four and a half inches at, and then it spreads out to seven eighth of an inch to two by two three quarters of an inch and then five sixteenths of an inch. Um, um, 
two eighth of an inch and one three eighth of an inch, two three quarters of an inch steel dial pin, two required press in place to manufacture. Another in shot piston wrench, um, breaking corners uh, five inches, number forty three drill, two holes, twenty five sixty four inch drill. Um, 7-2, emergency portion um, removal insulation. 7-4-2, a caution. Scribe, um, scrape wiper blow off of the jet low with the pressure air with all dirt adjacent with the gasket between the pipe bracket and the emergency valve portion. Use the blower hope. Blow off the emergency portion of the pipe bracket. Hope, hopper slopes, car under frames, and three of them, the lows of the dirt. Otherwise, get in the emergency portion of the pipe bracket with the portion is to be removed and reapplied. 7242, remove, remove the vent protector with the failed emergency portion of the ab, apply the Wabco for eight car product standard the vent pro, protector plug as shown in figure 17. 7243, the clean emergency portion must be handled with a care to avoid the entrance of the dirt in which could uh, the damaged internal parts. Important, the shipping cover must not be removed from the cleaning replacement emergency portion until ready to be mounted on the pipe rack of the car. 7244, move the emergency portion 1 from the pipe of the brake portion 7 and the first removing the 5 eighths of an inch hex nugs 8 with applying the shipping cover as shown in figure 15 with the tightening nuts. 7245, remove the scrap of the emergency portion mounting bracket um, gasket with the mounting face for the pipe bracket. 7246, visual inspection pipe bracket portion 7 for the damage of the portion need not to be removed from the emergency um, removed from the equipment arrangement unless it is damaged. If it is necessary to remove the pipe bracket portion, the car builder owner operating property instruction is fouled. It'd be fouled. Um, 7247, the inspection of the emergency portion mounting face of the pipe bracket portion 7, to be um, sure that the clean is not damaged or scratched, be sure that all the parts are clean and unrestricted necessary for the parts to be blown out, low pressure jet clean, drying screen, and disguise care between um, so that the, no dirt blown in the ports of the passage of the pipe, pipe portion 7. 7248, apply the new Webco 48 car product emergency portion mounting gasket to the pipe bracket 7. 7249, remove the vent protector plug with the new satisfactory repair tested emergency portion 1 and install with the cleaning vent port protector of the new emergency portion 1. Caution, warning, ABDXS, S, um, must be it not must not be applied to cars exceeding 39 feet in length. Such incorporate incorrect application may result in undesired break action that could result in equipment danger and injury to bystanders. 72410, remove the shipping cover of the new satisfactory retested tested emergency portion 1 immediately after the emergency portion 1 of the pipe bracket the coach threaded with the mounting stud lightly with the brake suit under lubricant M9114 compound consisting of one part, part graphite web pack specifica specification M076590502 AR specification M913 Two parts oil SA twenty by weight the um S two S two four eleven tighten the three through five eighths and text notes evenly firmly in order to sufficiently prevent gasket leakage yet not excessively cause the distortion of the mounted gaskets to suits S two four twelve. After the emergency portion has been reinstalled, the repairs have been completed and the entire air brake equipment must be tested in accordance with the latest issue with the code air brake system testing with the freight equipment T664742A slash BO. 725, um, service portion removal installation. 7251, disconnect the release valve handle and leaving it attached with the plate, plate, release rod, rod or rods. A caution, 7252, scrape wipe, scrape wipe and blow off the jet low pressure air with less than 30 pounds of PSI, all of the adjacent gasket between the pipe bracket and the service port, 7, service portion 3, using the blower hose, blow off the service portion 3 with the pipe bracket, 7, hopper, cooling, slopes, car, under frames, etc. 2, the frame, um, 3, them all, the loose dirt may otherwise than the service portion pipe bracket when the position is removed and Reapplied 7253 to clean the service portion must be handled with care to avoid an entrance of the dirt and water which could damage the internal parts. 7254 important the shipping covers must not be removed with the cleaning of the replacement surface portion until the ready to mount with the pipe bracket on the car. 7255 remove the safety of failed surface portion 3 and apply the shipping cover and tighten nuts. 7256 apply standard alternating stem guard 2 figure 16 to remove the surface portion holding it in place with a cotter pin. 7257 remove the surface portion mounting gasket 4 with the discard properly. 7258 remove the strainer nut 5 with using the strainer nut wrench then remove the discard old strainer 6. 7259 install the new strainer 6 with the wooden mandrel suit with the assistant grinding of the strainer and proper the position, making certain that the inner ends of the engagement with the ceiling of the bead inserted with properly all nuts threads will be visible to the insert strainer nut and vibe and tighten them firmly using the strainer nut wrench. Install a new surface portion mounting gasket warning the ABDX SS portion must not be applied to the cars exceeding 39 feet in length. Such incorrect application must be under sure desired brake application to cause the equipment damage and injury to the bystanders. 
72511. Remove the shipping cup with the new satisfactory repaired testing service break mount portion and three with immediately with applying the portion with the pipe bracket, seven with the coat of the threads mounting studs, they lightly leave the brake cylinder lubricate nine nine fourteen compound consisting of one part graphite web tech specification M zero seven six nine five zero two AR specification M nine thirteen two parts oil SAE twenty by weight. 725 um, 12. Tighten the 3 5 six, eighth inch hex nuts evenly with the firmly ordered sufficient preventing the gasket leak and yet not excessively causing distortion of mounting gasket. 725 13. Remo um, remove the leash valve stem guard with the new uh, over um, repaired service portion. Recon reconnect the release valve handles and handle, handle or handles which have been less attached with the release valve to release valve handle end plate of the new cotter pin. 72514. After the service portion has been reinstalled, all the repairs have been completed. The entire brake air equipment must be tested. Of course, with the latest issue with the code air brake test system testing of the freight equipment T664742A-B-O. 73 in shop maintenance important procedures. Important the procedure with the following air um, are to be performed in the repair, repair shop. The obtaining satisfactory operation or reliability device on the replacement part supplied by the Wild Tech Corporation are to be used in the maintenance for the device. Important when performing procedures followed, do not use hard, sharp metal tools to remove the gasket, oil rings, the dust boot, or the diaphragm. Excessive care should so that not not to damage the parts done done to this part. Warning: When the performing procedures which follow springs which ostensibly may be under load, excessive care must be taken. Not inadvertently expelled, inadvertently expelled parts may cause bodily injury and or damage parts. 7-4, disassembly of the ABDX SS emergency portion C figure 12. 741, remove the vent protector again. Um, assembly from the emergency portion 58. If it's still in place, the vent protector assembly not illustrated. 12, 742, small vent position in uh, check valve. 743, just press the spring retainer 28 into the body 58 until the, it, so it's free with the retaining lip of the body 58. Remove the strainer 28 with the vent valve spring 29. The small vent valve 23 in the body 58. To press the spring retainer into the fit 25 into the body 58 till it's free with the Retaining the body with the 58, remove the retainer 25 and check valve spring 26 from the check valve 27 from the body 58. Scrape the check valve 27. 745 emergency diaphragm pit piston, piston high speed, um, high pressure spooling, emergency accelerated release check valve. Figure 12 shows the ABDX SS aluminum emergency portion. Um, 746, remove the four one and a half by one and three quarter head, hex head screws one, which secure the top cover two for the body with the 58, remove the cover two. Remove the scrap, um, 747, remove the scrap of the ring gaskets two, 22, 23, and 24 from the top cover two. Know the thimble type of the air strainer 21 can be removed at the first, removing the retaining ring from the body 58, 748, remove the emergency accelerated release check valve with the spring 17 for the check valve spring 18, emergency accelerated release check valve 19, retaining ring 20, and the thimble type air strainer 21 from the body 55, 58, Grab the check valve 59. 749, remove the high pressure spool valve with the return spring 13 with the high pressure spool valve with the O ring 16 and 15 with the body with the 58. Note the easier removal thread of the 3 8 inch 16 cap screws into the high pressure spool. 7410, remove the scrap of the 5 1 3 16 inch OD rings 15 with the high pressure valve 16 714. 7411, carefully emergency diaphragm the piston assembly 3 to 12 as the position as unit in the bona fide and 58. So, um, 7412, carefully drift the 332 7 inch by 3 quarters of inch cylinder spring pin and six for the emergency slide valve eight remove the emergency slide valve eight evan filter nine and spring seven from the emergency piston ten Swim 413, remove the 5 8 inch 1 inch X head, head, head cap screw 3 from the secure the diaphragm follower 4 and diaphragm 5 to the emergency position 10 with the remove the follower 4 with the diaphragm 5 with the piston 10 scrape the diaphragm 5 Seven four fourteen. Remove the scrap of the two emergency wear rings eleven and twelve of the emergency piston ten vent valve in shot. The emergency accelerated release spool. Remove the two one and a half by one and one eighth hex head cap screws and one and a half and the one and a half and one three quarter hex head cap screws thirty four. Sorry thirty two. But the screw of the vent valve cover thirty three with the body of fifty eight. 7417, remove the in-shot piston spring 38 with the in-shot piston assembly 39 to 43 with the body shot um, from the body 58. 7418, remove the scrap of the um, 516 OD ring gasket 34 with the 5 OD ring gasket 35. The vent valve cover 33. 
Seven fourteen nineteen. Remove the scrap at the three oh eighth of an inch OD ring with the forty from the in shot piston. Forty one seven four twenty. Seven four twenty. Um, the for, use the in shot of the spanner with the wrenching of the shown with the figure twenty with the use for the in shot piston. Forty three with the remove the three eighths of an inch self locking nut. Knocks thirty nine with the piston. Forty three scrap with the nut. Thirty nine. Seven four twenty one. Remove the diaphragm follower. Di forty with the diaphragm. Forty one with the piston. Forty three scrape with the diaphragm. Forty one. 742 vent the um, with the vent valve piston diaphragm 36 for the vent valve piston 37 with the body 58 scrap the diaphragm 36. One of the cap nut 45 under the spring load with excessive exercise of the care but the no parts inadvertently expelled from the assembly inadvertently expelled part may cause bodily injury. 7423 using the 78 square inch move the move the cap nut with the O ring 45 through 44 secure the emergency accelerated release spring valve spool valve spring 46 emergency accelerated release valve for, um, spool valve 48 with the O rings 47 in the body 58. 7424, remove the emergency accelerated release spool valve spring 46 for the emergency accelerated release valve pool 48 with the O rings 47 with the body um, bottom of the body 56. 7425, remove the scrap of the four one and a half inch OD rings 47 from the spool valve 48, remove the scrap of the one and a half OD rings 44 from the cap nut 45. 75 assembly of the ABDX emergency portion C figure 12 emergency diaphragm piston high pressure spool emergency accelerator leash check valve Using number two silicone grease WAPTEP corporation specification M0768002 with code surf with the new one and a half inch OD rings 47 and light lubricating with the oil ring group the emergency accelerator leash spool valve 48 with the spool valve bushing surf with the 48 753 install the four new rings, lubricated in one and a half inch OD rings and 47 into the groove of the emergency accelerated release spool valve 48. 754 with the installing the emergency accelerated release valve 48 with the O rings 47 into the bush body 58 with the closed end first. 755 install the emergency accelerated release spool valve the spring 46 with the spool valve 48. 756 they apply the number two silicone grease wipe type corporation specification M076880 M07. 0768022 surf with the new one and a half inch OD ring light lubricated with the one green one green ring groove with the cap nut 45. Install the new lubricated one and a half inch OD ring with the 44 and then install with the cap nut 45. Um, install the cap nut with the O ring 45 and 44 into the body 58 and secure the spring with the 46 to the celebrated release spool without 48 with the O rings and 47 in place. Use the 7 eighths of inch square wrench tighten the cap nut with the 45 and in between the 55 and 65 foot pounds of the torque. 759 and install the emergency wear ring 11 and 12 on the emergency piston. Important carefully. Sh care should be taken to see with it when expanding them opening the wear rings during the installation emergency piston do not extend the, expand the, expand the um, rings cause them to deform which would result in defect, difficult installation piston and bore and protective rings should be installed with the gap at the facing the slide valve area with the emergency portion the piston of the rings will assembly easily ease to assemble 7510 install the new emergency di piston diaphragm 5 on the emergency piston 10 so that the piece of the number um, or the, on the diaphragm is facing away from the piston. Lightly coat the threads of 5 8 of inch 1 inch hex head hex cap screw hex head screw with a Loctite sealant TL242 Wabtech Corporation specification M0749905. Install the cap screw 3 to the diaphragm follower into the piston 10 to secure. The piston 10 with the diaphragm 5 with the follower 4 together and, and tighten the cap screw 3 with the flip of the diaphragm 5 in the opposite direction so the large cone shaped open in the facing piston 10 for screw, the screw 3 from between 45 and 50 pound foot pounds. Some 512 install the emergency slide valve spring with the 7 in which the emergency slide valve 8 and 5 to 13 carefully um, place the emergency slide valve in the spring 8 7 with the same in the piston 10 with the screw of the parts from the placing installing 332 7 by 3 quarters of an inch cylindrical spring temp pin. 7514 use the foam tipped applicator event evenly spread the light coat of the triple valve wab tip corporation specification M0760110 20 air specification M912 um, over the uh, over the face of the emergency slide valve 8 Seven five fifteen evenly spread the light coating with the triple valve oil on the side of the slide valve of the bushing seating on the body fifty eight E seven five sixteen evenly spread a light coating with the triple valve oil over the guard portion of the ten piston on the end of this in ten Care must be taken when compromising slide valve piston um, followed by springs in preparation inserting the emergency piston valve 3 to 10 but into the body bushing when using the minimal force assembly must be as lined with securely to prevent the edging any wedging distortion of slide valve, for, slide valve face 8 must be retracted with the bushing face as long as possible. 
7517, install the diaphragm piston emergency slide valve assembly 3 to 10 with the body 358. Exercise care to that so that no damage is done to the emergency slide valve on the bushing seat. 587518, a unit of the pressure with the thumb and finger piston using sealed bead the diaphragm, the diaphragm, breathe group body of the 58, 7519, coat the surface of the 5 new 31316 spinach OD rings 15 with number 2 silicone grease, Wobtech Corporation, specification M07. 68002 light lubricated with the O-ring groove with a high pressure spool valve 16 with the bearing of the surface of the spool valve bushing on the body 58. 7520 install the 5 new lubricated 1 3 16 with an OD rings and 15 and then they're grooved with a high pressure spool valve 16. Install high pressure spool valve um, O rings 16 and 15 on the body. Install the high pressure spool valve with retain ring return spring 13 on the high pressure spool valve 16. Install the new thimble air type of the air strainer 21 into the emergency accelerated check valve seat of the body 58. And secure the thimble type of the air strainer 21 into the body 58 with a retaining ring 20. 7524 install the new emergency accelerated release check valve 19 the check valve spring seat 18 the check valve spring 17 into the body 858 install the new one and three quarters inch OD ring gasket 22 and the new one and a half inch OD ring gasket 23 and the new one and one eighth OD ring gasket and 24 into the group the top cover 2 place the top of the cover of the assembly two ring with the two with the ring gaskets 22 23 and 24 on the body with 58 making sure that the diaphragm and five ring gaskets 22 and 23 and 24 remain in position um, secure the cover to two of the body of the 58 installing the four one and a half one three quarter inch hex head cap screws torque screws between 35 and 55 pound foot pounds 7528 vent valve and shot piston emergency accelerated release spool. Install the new in shot diaphragm 41 on the in shot piston 43 with the splash over the diaphragm, which showed that the number of the faces away from the piston. Install the diaphragm follower 40 with the piston 40, um, 43 so that the small diameter follower 40 in the face of the diaphragm 41, the selector valve 40, the diaphragm 41, in shot piston 43. Installing the new 3 8 range 16 self locking the half screw 39 torque net with 9 to 12 foot pounds. 7531 apply number two silicone grease Wobtep Corporation specification M076802 for the specific surface of the new 3 8 inch OD ring 42. Also light lubricate O ring groove with the short shaft in shot bottom piston um, 43 and the bearing surface of the in shot piston on the body 58. 75332 install the new lubricated 3 8 inch OD ring into the um, 42 into the groove of the shaft of the piston 43. 7533, inst install the in shop diaphragm piston assembly 39 to 43 inch of the body 58. Be sure to bead the diaphragm 41 with the properly seat with the bed bead groove of the body 58. 7535, install the in shop piston ring 38 over the 39, nut 39 and expose the end of the in shop piston 43 to, so that the spring seat of the diaphragm follow 43. 40. 7535, using a foam tip swab applicator evenly spread a light coating of the triple valve oil wab type corporation specification M076. 1120 AR, AR specification M912 with the large diameter surface of the stem of the vent valve piston 37. Carefully insert the vent valve piston 37 in the body. 58. 7536. Place the new vent valve piston diaphragm 36 on the vent valve piston 37. Ensure the part number of the diaphragm face of the piston with the aid of the hand and the tool of the drawn figure 6 with the properly piston diaphragm 36. The loop of the diaphragm site between the piston 37 and the body 58. 3537, install the new 15 16th inch O ring gasket um, 34 on the new 5 8th inch O ring ga OD ring gasket 35 in the group of the vent valve 33. 7538, place the vent valve cover 33 on the body 58 and install two 1.5 inch by 1 and 1 8th inch hex head cap screw 31 with the metal identification tag 29A and the 1.5 by 1 and 3 quarter inch hex head cap screw 32. 7539, um, small vent valve in shot check valve. 7540, install the new in shot check valve 27 the in shot check valve spring 26 within the body 58, lining the properly secure with these parts in place and installing the in shot priming of the retainer 25. 7541, Using a foam tip swab applicator, evenly spread a light coat with the triple valve wab tap corporation specification M076120, air specification M912, to the out diameter small vent valve position 30, with install the small vent valve piston assembly 30 in the seal first for the body 58. Install the small vent valve piston spring 29 with the small vent valve 30 with the screw in place and install with the spring retainer 28 in the body 58. Be sure to retain the 28 and um, properly secured. Our right, figure 13. Figure 13 shows the ABDX SS service portion 664743 part number.
Disassembly ABDX surface portion, C figure 13 and 14. Remove the release valve portion 54 for the body with the 49, but remove the first 3 8 by an inch flax head cap screw. Remove the scrap of the 5 with the 3 3 16 inch O ring gasket, the 56 for the 7 8 of an inch O ring gasket, the 55 for the mounting face with the release valve portion. Remove the wire mesh strainer 57 of the body 49. 763 so that the release valve portion 54 is uh, aside in the clean protective area later disassembly serve the diaphragm piston remove the top of the cover tube with the body 49 with the removing the four one and a half one and three quarters inch head, head scrap hex head cap screws one remove the scrap and the 161 and 116th holding ring gasket three with the top of the cover tube with the carefully remove the surface portion assistant emily four through 17 the unit, unit uh, from the unit body 49. Piston surface position 4 through 17, 4 to 17 surface position, uh, assembly fixture in part number 564522 two, shown in figure 8 with the holder surface position, assembly piston position in the slide valve for ring of the 13, use the reset the fixture with the slide, set the slide, seat the slide valve 15 up facing upward. Using the driver pin with the furnace with the piston holding the fixture carefully, drift the 3 30 32 three, inch by 1 inch cylindrical spin, spring pin in um, from the slide valve 15. Remove the slide valve spring 12 with the slide valve 15, graduating valve 14, graduating valve spring 13 from the surface piston 16. Remove the one five eight inch, one inch, inch cax head cap screws for or from the secure of the diaphragm 5 with the diaphragm 6 of the surface position, piston 17. 7, 6, 12. Remove the diaphragm follow from the diaphragm 6 with the surface position, piston 16, spy, for, scrape the diaphragm 6. Remove the spring seat retaining ring 7 from the tail of the surface position, piston 16, but remove the spring seat with 8 and spring 9 and spring guide 10. Remove the scrap of the surface piston 17 from the surface position 16. 7, 16, 14. Limiting backflow check valve 7, 6, and 15. Remove the 4, 1, and a half, 1, and quarter inch hex head cap screw 33, which screw the bottom of the 4, cover 44, and body 49. One at the bottom of the cover the 44 with under the spring load of the exercise of the care, but the, so that no parts are inadvertently expelled with the assembly, inadvertently expelled, but the parts may be the cause of bodily injury. Remove the bottom of the cover 34 from the body 49. Remove the scrap of the 11, 16th of an inch OD ring gasket 38 with the 2 inch OD ring gasket 35 with the 2 inch flange flange fitting gasket 39 from the cover 34. Remove the check valve, valve spring 36 with the check valve, the 37 in the body, 49 scrap the check valve, 37. Remove the brake cylinder limiting valve, spring 42 with the diaphragm, valve 43. Check the brake cylinder limiting valve, diaphragm 44 in the body, 49. Removing the scrap, the O-rings 46 and 47 from the brake cylinder limiting the valve. So, um, remove the piston and return spring 40 for the spring with the cage and from the body 49, 722. Accelerated surface release valve, um, accelerated surface release valve. Remove the surface accelerated release valve cover the 19 wear protection disc 20 of the diaphragm piston and strength play 21 through 24 as resulting filling the piece with the 31 with the first removing the four, one and a half, two and three quarter inch hex head cap screws 8, 18. Remove the screw accelerated result, release valve position diaphragm 21 through 24 with the cover 19. 726, 725. Using the surface accelerated release valve piston spray and a wrench is shown in figure 20, but to hold the surface accelerated release valve piston 24, remove the 9 and 16th minute sex as that not. 21 diaphragm valve over 22, the diaphragm 23, and from the head of the end of the piston 24, the scrape the diaphragm 23. Note, if required, that use the flat bar pit placed in pit slot on the rectangle of the surface of the accelerated release position 24 and remove the 9 16th minute hex head nut 21. All right, figure 20, 14 shows the ABX release valve portion of part number 566198. All right, continuing reading. 7626. Remove the surface portion filling piece um, with the plunger check valve assembly mounting gasket 25 through 32 with the unit from the body 49. Remove the scrap of the filling piece with the mounting gasket 32 with the compressor with the removing the spring seat 28. Check with the valve spring. Accelerate release check valve 30 with the filling piece 31. Scrap with the check valve 30. Remove the surface accelerate relief valve plunger with the O ring 25 and 26 pushing it out of the cover in. And with the filling piece with the removing the scrap with the one quarter inch O ring with the 26 with the end of the plunger 25. Remove the scrap with the 11 16 the O ring gasket 27 from the groove of the filling piece.
76381, um, remove the release valve portion of the 54, put the release preset aside of the cleaning protected area. 7623, disassemble the release valve portion, so you figure 14, remove the figure 5, 3 8 inch, 1 and a half, one and a half hex, hex headed cap screw, 1, which secure the top cover 2, put the release valve portion with the release valve body 40, 35, remove the top of the cover from the body 35, remove the scrap of the 2, 1 inch of OD ring gasket 3 from the groove of the top cover 2, remove the 2 check spring valve 12, put the auxiliary emergency reserve check valve spring 13, 2 check Check valve plungers 14 with them and from the body 35. Scrap the two check valve 7, 6, 37. Then remove the spool valve ring, um, valve spring with the body with 35. Remove the spool valve diaphragm valve. Follow word diaphragm assembly 5 to 11 from the body 35. This is unit. Remove the scrap of the three, oh, three quarters of an inch OD ring gaskets from the groove of the spool valve. 10. Using the open end wrench to hold the spell valve. 10. Remove the um, 3 eighths of an inch self locking uh, 5 from the diaphragm follower. Six the diaphragm solid seven and the piston O ring eight and nine from the thread of the end of the spool valve with the ten remove the one quarter inch O D ring gasket nineteen or O D ring nine groove, um, and from its groove within the piston eight with scrap the O ring and nine with the diaphragm seven with the self locking nine five. Remove the scrap of the three kit sixteen inch two inch cotter pin with the twenty four with the screw of the release valve stem with the guard twenty five the stem end plate twenty seven remove the stem guard twenty five. One of the bottom cover thirty one is under the spring load of the exercise care that something that so the parts inadvertently expelled with the assembly exhalation accidentally expelled parts may cause bodily injury. Seven six four two for the remove of the five with the three eighths inch one three quarter of an inch hex head cap screws that secure the fifteen for that secure the bottom of the cover of the valve seat exhaust seal stem and the end plate twenty seven through thirty three with the body thirty five remove the cover set leave for the body thirty five six four thirty three remove the semi end plate thirty seven with the body cover the basket twenty seven twenty eight seal thirty for the five eighth inch OD and gasket twenty nine from the cover thirty one wrap the gasket twenty eight and twenty nine and seal thirty. Remove the fillet lifter 26 of the lifter spring 23 from the body of the 35. Remove the bottom cover sleeve 34 from the bottom of the cover 31. Cut off a head of the 3 to 8, 16 to an inch, 1 and a half inch aluminum pop rivet the 33 with remove the cut rivet 33 and seal the 32 with the bottom of the cover 31. Scrap the rivet 33 and seal 32. 6, 30, 47 the remove the retaining check valve 20 with the spring with the 19 with the body 35. Scrap the check valve 20. 7, 6, 48 remove the rest of the check valve spring 22 from the reset check valve 21 with the body 35. Scrap the check valve 21. 747649 remove the reset spool valve of the O ring assembly 18 and 17 reset the spool valve spring 16 with the body 35 650 remove the scrap of the three quarter inch OD rings of the reset the spool 18. All right, your assembly with the ABDX SS service portion C figure 13 service the divide ram piston install the service piston ring 17 on the service piston. So, and care should be taken with the expanding of the opening of the service piston rings during the installation of the service piston. Not over expand the rings causing them to deform which will result in the difficult installation of the piston into the bore. The service piston ring should be installed with a gap facing in the slide valve of the area with the service port piston. The position of the rings will easily assemble the 773. The position piston the new diaphragm 6 for the service piston 16 with the part number of the diaphragm 6 for the face away from the piston 16. After the piston of the diaphragm beat of the groove and then piston and flip the diaphragm and stick for the zone that the large cone should be opening the base follower. 7474 twice from the diaphragm 5 of the diaphragm 6 of the piston 16. Locate. Low, lightly coat the threads with the 5 8 minus 1 6 and that hex head cap screw Loctite sealant TL 242. And so the cap screw 4 for the diaphragm 5 of the instant, uh, instant into the piston 16. To secure the piston 16 with the diaphragm 6 for the power 5 together. And tighten the cap screws 4 with the flip of the diaphragm 6 for the end of the opposite. Up, uh, Directions so that the large cone should be opening in the face position. 16 torque screw with between 45 and 55, 50 pounds. Using a foam tip with swab applicator, evenly spread the light coat with the triple valve with the oil with the WabTech Corporation specification, um, AR specification M912 around the surface of the piston, spraying guide the 10 with the bearing of the surface of the piston, bushing, install the piston spring guide 10 with the closed end first of the open end for the piston 16, install the piston spring 9 with the spring C8 into the open end of the spring guide 10 with the screw of the parts and placing the installing the spring retainer 7. 779. Place the slide valve to weld well, in the holding fixture of the part number 564522 two, shown in figure 8. Using the foam tip of the swab the applicator, then evenly spread a light coating of the triple valve oil with the wab type corporation AR specification M912 on the face of the graduating valve 14 over the graduating valve sleeve. You have the slide valve 15. Install the graduating valve spring 13 with the graduating valve 14. Slide valve 15 onto the piston 16. Place the piston assembly on the slide valve spring with the 12 wheel still on holding fixture. Make sure the graduating valve 14 is on the seat of the slide valve and the slide valve swan. 
windings of the diamond of the type. Pictures of install the 3 and 3 332 Spanish one cylindrical spring with the 11 through the pinhole for the each of the wings. The slide valve 15 with the line pull the pinhole with the slide valve 13 with the aid of the pin driver. The supply with the holding fixture part number 564522. Secure the pin 11 in pla place. 7715. Remove the sum of the holding fixture. Use the foam tips to wobble the look applicator with the evenly spread of light coat of the triple valve oil blobby type corporation M0761120 with the air specification M912 over the place of the slide valve of the air and surface piston ring 17 over the surface piston 16. Let's also apply the lighting coat of the triple valve over the slide valve seat with the valve bushing in the 49 and the collars and fins, pins, pins of the piston 16 near the piston assembly. Important care must be taken with pressing the graduating valve with the slide valve preparation inserting with the piston valve assembly brings 4 through 17 into the body bushing while using minimal force assembly must be aligned squarely to prevent the edging of the wedging wedge, any wedging distortion of the slide valve face it must be retracted with the bushing of the face as long as possible care must be taken not to damage the slide valve seats. 7717 installing the diaphragm slide valve assembly 4 through 17 to install the body 49 from the top of the sizing so that no damage is done to the slide valve seat. Um, 7718, using only the finger thumb press position of the ceiling bead with the diaphragm 16 with the diaphragm bead with the groove in the top cover the mounting face on the body 49. Install the new 1 and 1 16 inch OD ring gasket into the groove with the top cover 2. Insert two guide pins with the diagonally opposite thread holes with the body of the 49. Using the piston guide as piston with the cover assembly 2 and 3 on the body 49 with the retaining thread holes in the hat by hand 2, 1 and a half inch, 1 three quarter inch. Half hex head cap screws. Remove the two guide pins. Install the two 1 and 1 half through 1 and Three quarters hex head cap screws. Torque of all four cap screws between 35 and 55 pounds. Seven. 7721 Limiting valve backflow check valve used in the foam tip with a swab applicator evenly spread a light coating with the triple valve oil with wab tap corporation M0761120 with the AR specification M912 around the color end of the spring cage 41. Install the piston return spring of the four with the spring cage. Install the cage with spring, with spring 41 and 40 with the unit of the body 49. So the spring 40 goes over and around the end of the shaft and the piston 16, which already has been installed. Um, piston the new diaphragm 44 on the break of the cylinder limiting valve 45 stem valve stem of the 45 with the surface of the diaphragm show the swelling the part number of the faces away from the stem for the throttle and thre threaded in. 7725 using the number two silicone grease wap tap corporation and lubricant surface of the number two with the O rings 46, 47 and 46 lubricant. The old rings of the groove of the show, shafting of the stem 45 of the bearing force of the, force of the piston, pushing in body 49. Install the spring seat with the diaphragm 45 through 48 into the body 49. O ring end of the first. Be sure that the beat of the diaphragm 44 is properly seated with the groove and the fly body of the finger pressure to seat the body. Bead. Install the diaphragm follower 43 in the brake cylinder and limiting the valve spring 42 in the body 49 with the seats on the diaphragm follower 44. 7728 into the new black flow check valve 37 of the check valve spring 36 of the property cap of the body 49 install new 2 inch flange filling and hitting gasket 39 with the new 2 inch OD ring gasket new 11 16 inch OD ring gasket 38 with the grooves in the bottom cover 34 carefully position the bottom cover to assembly 34 35 and 38 and 39 on the body 49 with make sure that all the gas assemblies on the body are properly in place securing the bottom cover 34 into the cover of the body 49 installing the 4 1 and a half inch 1 and quarter inch hex head cap screw 33 equally in turn with the screws between 35 and 55 pounds 731 accelerate service release valve install the new accelerated release check valve 30 into the service position filling 31 7732 install the check valve 29 with the filling piece 31 in the seat of the check valve 30 with the installing the spring seat 28 Retaining the parts in place. Um, seven seven thirty four. A new filling um, filling piece of the ga basket thirty two with the surface portion filling piece thirty one of the position and the body forty nine. Apply the light coat of the number two silicone grease wap tap corporation specifications are for the new one and one quarter inch sorry one quarter inch OD ring with lubricated with the O ring groove with the surface of the accelerator release the valve plunger twenty five of the being surface of the plunger for pushing and the filling of piece. Install the new lubricated one quarter inch OD ring and 26 of the groove with the short end of the service of the accelerated release valve plunger 25. Install the plunger O ring 26 and 25. The filling piece 31 longer ends of the plunger first. 7736. The accelerated release valve position span of wrench is shown in figure 10 with the two holes to serve the accelerated release valve position of the 24. Install the new diaphragm 23 and another piston 24 when the part number of the diaphragm faces away from the piston toward the thread end. 7738. Install the diaphragm follower 22 and the light coat of the threads and service accelerated release valve piston. 
24 Black Tie Sealant TL 242 Wabtec Corporation installed the 916th of an inch nut on 21 on the threaded end of the position 20, piston 24 with torque nut 21 on between the 40 to 55 pounds. Install the diaphragm piston assembly 21 through 24 end of the first uh, first filling piece of 31. Be sure that the piston bead of the diaphragm is properly sealed with the groove of the filling piece of 31. Use the finger pressure to properly seat diaphragm bead. Install the wear protection disc of the 20 on the hex nut 21. The disc lies of the follower 22. It is not held in place by any means, but um, by the body will have to be positioned so the disc may remains in place while the installing the cover 19. The new 1 11 16. If install the new 11 16, there will be no ring gasket 26. Then do the cover of the groove of the mounting piece, face of the filling piece 30. Place the service accelerator release valve cover the 19 in position with the filling piece 30. Be sure all the parts are properly positioned. Use the four, one and a half, two and a three quarter inch hex head scrap screws. 18 screw the cover and filling piece with 19 through 31 to the body 49. Equally torque screws between 18 between 35 and 55 pounds. Release valve portion assembly. Use the number two silicone Wattep Corporation specification. You lightly lubricated the surface of the three number, new three quarter inch OD ring. Get 17 air light lubricate all of the rings of the spool valve. 18 bearings the surface of the spool valve bushing with the release valve portion of the body. 35. 7745. Install a new lubricated three quarter inch OD ring. Get 17 with the groove of the spool valve. 18. Install the spool valve spring. 16 with the spool valve O ring. 17 and 18. The release valve body. 835. Install the lifter spring. 23 with the lifter. 26. End of the proper cavity with the release valve 35 install a new reset check valve 30, 21 of the check valve spring 22 with the proper cavity of the release valve body 35 Seven seven forty nine. Install the check valve spring nineteen of the new retaining check valve twenty with the proper cap of the release valve body thirty five with the seating the retaining check valve with the locating the bottom of the cover seven seven fifty of the install the bottom cover sleeve thirty four inch screw the new seal thirty two of the new three sixteen inch one and a half inch aluminum pop rivet thirty three with the bottom cover thirty one install the new valve seal thirty with the stem and the end plate twenty six of the new five eighth inch o ring ring gasket twenty nine and the new bottom cover of the gasket and twenty eight in place with the bottom cover seven fifty two. Careful position the bottom of the cover assembly twenty seven through thirty four to the body thirty five without Applying the heavy pressure, then insert the 5 3 8 inch 1 3 quarter inch exit cap, cap, cap screws 15 into the cover 31. Observe the retaining check valve 20 to be sure that it is aligned with the check valve seat cover 31. Also be sure to reset the check valve spring 22 is properly positioned in cover 31. And the hand, hand press the cover 31 to the body of the 35 secured in place equally. Lighten the, tighten the 5 3 8 inch 1 3 quarter inch hex head cap screws 15 to a torque valve between 15 and 25 foot pounds. Using number two silicone grease, Wabtec Corporation specification lightly coat the surface of the new one and a half inch OD ring. The new one, new three quarter inch OD ring is 11. Also located with the OD ring groove, the spool valve 10, and the being surface of the spool valve bushing 35. Oh, uh, using an open end of the wrench to hold the spool valve 10, install the piston 8 and thread end of the spool valve 10. Install the new lubricated one and a half inch OD ring 9 with the place in the position 8. Install the new diaphragm 7 so the part number of the diaphragm faces away from the piston toward the red end of the spool 10. And so the diaphragm follower stick of the new cell three to eight man six like sil self locking hex nut with the thread end of the spool with the valve ten with the curve of the parts together with the torquing nut five to twelve to fourteen foot pounds. And so the new lubricated three quarter inch O D ring um Install the three O ring groove with the spool valve 10. Install the diaphragm piston assembly 5 through 11 body and 35. Be sure to be, be the diaphragm um seven is Properly seated in the bead of the groove body, the 35 of the finger pressure seated with the bead of the groove, then install the spool ring valve with the body with 35 of the seat of the diaphragm follower, install the emergency auxiliary reserve check valve plunger 14 with the property cavity of the body 35, install the new check valve 13 with the body 35 at the top of the plunger, two plunger 14 to install the two check valve spring 12. This is all new one inch OD ring gaskets in the groove at the top of the cover carefully placed over the top of the cover two and three with the body of the thirty five. Be sure that the springs at four and three and twelve are properly positioned in spring cavity with the cover the screw at the top of the cover two with the body of the thirty five install the five three eighths inch one and one half inch hex head scap screws. Equally torque the screws between fifteen and twenty five pounds. Install the three clean wired mesh filter screens fifty seven place the release valve portion forty eight install the new seven eighths inch OD ring gasket fifty five and the five new mountain five thirteen sixteenth OD ring gasket fifty six with the groove of the mountain with the face release valve portion 58. 7766. Place release valve 58 on the surface portion body with the skirt to be place installing 3 3 8 minus flex head flange hex knots 53. Equally torque the knots between 11 and 30 foot, foot pounds. 
Seven seven sixty seven. The reef valve stem guard twenty five inch installed, but the after service portion being tested. Use the new three point sixteen seven inch two inch cotter pen twenty four with installing the guard twenty five seven eight cleaning inspection seven eight one non reusable parts important all gasket O rings and self locking elastic sob nuts diaphragms and wear rings are not are to be scraped and replaced with the new Wabtec Corporation part parts. 782 reusable parts. 78 caution. 7821 wash all reusable parts and cleaning solvent described in section 6 spring with the maybe wire brush and to assist removal any of the dirt and rust and scale that can also there. Care must be taken not to damage the spring. Important cleaning um, caution. Cleaning solvents are to be used with well ventilated area. 782 2. The operating portion may be completely dismantled. All portion parts of the inspector cleaning parts and the body interior may be clean. Improved methods to dissolve the grease with the damage of the parts must be body must be. Now it's emergent solution. The wire brush should be may be used to assist the removal of any light dirt, surface dirt, resource, and scale cast of the parts of the exterior of the body must be thoroughly cleaned. All piston slide valves, graduating valve, the bushings must be thoroughly cleaned. To do this, the bushing the piston and the slide valve, the graduating valve assembly must be dismantled. After the parts have been cleaned, but this they must they must be completely dried using a low pressure jet clean the dry air below the pressure dry. Testing and additional information after the ABDX SS control valve has been assembled before that has been returned to service, it is possible to pass a series of tests following the procedure of the current the issue of the Wabtec Corporation test specification T6647428 slash B0. Important the ABDX SS portion are not to be applied with the cars exceeding 39 feet in length. Extremely caution may, be, may must be taken to ensure that the portion is really due. Like, replace like position of the car failure to heed these instructions may result in the equipment of danger, damage or in personal injury. 83. Important. When installing emergency service before both portion and over the ABDX SS pipe bracket portion, new Gaskins filters may be used. See section 72. Our figure 15 shows the shipping covers. Figure 16 shows the release valve stem guard. Figure 17 shows the vent protector plug. A4. Important. Whenever the emergency of the service portion, remove the equipment arrangement for any reason to reinstall, replace new, prepared, or tested portion. The ABDX SS control valve must be tested to ensure that it works properly with the conjunction reminder of the brake equipment. So your Wabtec Corporation respect, respect, representative and additional information is required. Once again, that was the ABDX SS control valve part number 66472, ABDX SS aluminum service portion and aluminum emergency portion, um, operation maintenance and instruction.